Hello everyone and welcome to Lavelia's Coloring. I am going to unbox my 10th and 11th box from Felicimo and we will see which Tokyo Seeds colored pencil set I received. I am unboxing two this time because real life this summer has been taking priority so I am behind with these Felicimo videos but hopefully I can catch up so if these pencils are new to you, I did purchase them as a subscription and that subscription lasts for 25 months where each month you will receive a set of 20 colored pencils that were put together in a color theme. And once I receive my last set, the subscription immediately ends and I should have a total of 500 Felicimo Tokyo Seeds colored pencils. So again, this is the 10 and 11th out of the 25 and if you want to hear more about my subscription process please check out my first unboxing video of these sets and also check out my second unboxing video where I share a review of these pencils along with how I swatched them you can find those links up above in the eye icon and also down below in the video description and I have a playlist for this collection so I'll also have that link provided and so we'll go ahead and get started with this unboxing. Okay, so I have them out of the boxes. You can see they are nicely wrapped in the bubble wrap. So this is from box number 10 and box number 11. I can already see the dark colors on this one and then the very nice like turquoise and purple colors on this. So let me go ahead and open this one first. So here is the coloring craft card for this set. Let's just quickly see what this one is. So they have instructions in both English and in Japanese. And it looks like a little cutout house, which you can color in. Very cute. And then here is the card that has the swatch and the name of this set. So the name is home. So here is the inspiration picture for this set. So this one is from 281 to 300. And here's a little poem right over here that says, just like a children's nursery rhyme, my home flows with family and time. The delicious aroma of Sunday meals are enjoyed together in our daily lives. So in here, you have the little swatch card, but um, I don't use this. I use my own swatch card that I just put together that I can quickly see, and it's small enough to just have in front of the case. And I usually fold this like this. So this is home. Now let's go ahead and see the pencils. Let me go ahead and zoom you guys in. Okay, so we're going to start off with this one up here. And this one says, Good Night Kiss. Very nice dark green. This one says, Luscious Lawn. Then we have Pesto Presto. Here is Country Shingle. We have Gingerbread, oops, Gingerbread Bites. Carrot Cake. This one is Beach House Sand. Very pretty color. This one is Humble Habitat. Then we have Fresh Linen. 
Then we have Cradle, Careful. A lot of subtle colors. And then in the next row, we have Bungalow Brilliant. Summer Quilt. Plantation Shutter. Cucumber Crisp. Oh, it's pretty. I like that color. Next one is Rocking Chair. I'm sorry. Broccoli Mash. Nursery Rhymes. Marigold Magic. mom's recipe and then the last one is cobblestone memories that's a pretty one but you can already see very nice subtle colors these would be great for fall i think would be a nice set to color a illustration using this colors so this is a home. Let me go ahead and zoom you out. So here it is. Let me go ahead and put this one aside really quick. And then I'm going to open the other set, which is number 11. here off to the side so I can already see the colors very pretty so let me go ahead and quickly take out the bubble wrap okay so here is the coloring craft card and then the card for it. So here you can see very pretty. It's like summery colors. Reminds me of the beach for some reason. And so here is the coloring craft card for set 11 for, for me. And then again, instructions in Japanese and in English. Here's the little crafting I think it's a little bag, so you decorate the outside and then you cut it out and then put it together. Very cute. And then here is the swatch card for this and the name for this set is Serenity. So Serenity is number 421 to 440 and a little poem in here it says the tranquil color of water forms a feeling of calmness serene surroundings creates peace take a moment to unwind and rest and here is the inspiration picture for this set and then again the swatch card but i am going to be swatching it in my own card Let's go ahead and look at the pencils. Okay, let me go ahead and open the case. So here is the 20 colored pencils for Serenity. Let me go ahead and zoom you guys in to show you the names of these pencils. Okay, so the first one is Serene Seclusion. Next one is Just Zen. Next one is Riviera Retreat. Then we have Quartz, Qu um, Quartz Calm. Baby Boy. It's a cute one. Cute color. 
Next one is Waterfall Wishes. Next one is Nearly Nirvana. We have Quiet Life. Happy Place. Graceful Unison. And then in the next row, we have Oasis Cruise. Lucid Dreams. Sky Still. Collected Cool. Ocean Drift Tree Pose Mary Matcha Everly Elderflower What's this? Lust Lead Leaves and then chamomile mist. And I can already see that these are very subtle colors, also, but in the lighter side compared to home. So, this one again is Serenity. And let me go ahead and fix the card the way I usually put it. Oh, there we go. There, and go ahead and put this so I'll be back in a second so I have here serenity and home they are all in number order and sharpened the pencil sharpener that I like to use for these Felicimo pencils is the doll 133 and because these Felicimo pencils are square barreled they fit nicely in the doll 133 it also has rubber grips on them so you won't have to worry about leaving dents on your pencil so this sharpener has become my favorite sharpener to use for all of my sets just because of the rubber grips too so i am going to do a speed coloring of these swatch cards that i have ready here for both serenity and home i'm going to start off with home first and then the serenity set and then i'll be right back so i'm going to go ahead and zoom you guys in and start off with the swatches
So here we are with the completed swatches of Home and Serenity. So starting off with Home, I really like the warm and subtle colors. There are colors in here that I know I would probably use for skin tones like Gingerbread Bites, Carrot Cake, Beach House Sand maybe, and Mom's Recipe. And yeah, I really love the greens in this one too. Very beautiful set. So this one is Home. And then here for Serenity is all cool, soft colors. Of greens and blues and purple right over here. But... Yeah, the Serene Seclusion, you can barely see any color on that one. That is more of a cool gray, like one. <laughs> so the lightest cool gray and then Oasis Cruise is another. To me, it looks like cool gray too. But I like the soft turquoise colors, the soft greens. And yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun trying to pick out illustrations to color using these sets. I have an idea for Serenity, but I have to look at that illustration again to see if I can use all of these colors in that page. And then it'll be a lot of fun trying to find a illustration to color using the home. So I'm going to go ahead and put these aside really quick. And then share with you a couple of completed colorings that I used um, with the previous Tokyo Seed sets that I shared earlier. And the first one is Sophisticated. So here are the colors. Let's show you. Very beautiful colors. And the page that I used to color with this set is from Johanna Basford's Worlds of Wonder and I colored the nameplate page which is this one and I really love how it came out and I did use each and every one of the pencils from this set on this page and I've been thinking of using this set again, maybe for the opposite page, but I'm not sure. <laughs> I might not have, if I have time in the future, I will go ahead and do that. So this is the page that I colored using the sophisticated set. And then I have one more. which is the party set. So this is the neon colors, which I've said in the unboxing for this one that it's not my favorite kind of colored pencils to use to color, but I took it as a challenge to use all of these colors for one page. And here I showed how it looks like against black background very bright you can see that i really used them up a lot and the book that i colored in is tales from the masquerade or midnight masquerade that is from hannah carlson and the page i colored in here is this cake and cupcakes page. I did put acrylic in the background. I used the neon colors of the party set to color this in. So the cakes, cupcakes, the background right here, the fireworks. Um, there's only some gel pens that I used in here like the Sakura jelly roll, white jelly roll for the fireworks, Sakura metallic, I also used some paint pens to cover the black lines, but yeah, this was very challenging. I actually, the reason why these are short is because uh, I used those pencils to color in the cake and I did color it in and then I didn't like it. So I erased it and then I started over again and I liked the result for the second time, <laughs> second coloring. So 
Yeah, so again, I used each and every one of the colors in this set for this page. And yeah, very, very challenging, but very happy with the way this page turned out. Especially how much it pops out from the black background. Okay, so that is my page from Tales from the Midnight Masquerade by Hannah Carlson using the party Tokyo Seed set from Felicimo. So that is it. Let me go ahead and bring back the sets that I shared in this video. So yeah, very excited to find illustrations to color with these sets, both Home and Serenity. And hopefully I, I can finish it up and share it with you in a future video. So I hope you guys had fun seeing this unboxing from Felicimo. And I thank you all so, so much for stopping by and watching. And I'll see you all in my next video. Please take care and keep safe and happy colorings. Bye-bye. <laughs>